Oh, hey everybody, I'm Blitz. Welcome to another game that's got four letters for an acronym, and I feel like they just kind of went to an encyclopedia and they said words, and it's, they came up with Animal Revolt Battle Simulator. I don't really understand the name of it, but we're gonna, you know, have a revolt of animals and stuff. So we might as well just give ourselves a beautiful green valley. Oh, look how nice that is. It's valley in green and stuff. Cool. We can select our units. Now, my favorite thing about this game is there's all sorts of fun stuff. Like, I don't know, we can make a Gorgon, whatever that is. We'll put him over here. Look at that. That, my friends, is a Gorgon. There's also a Hydra. Wow, I can't words. There we go. Give me the Hydra. We need a Hydra. Can I turn you? There you go, buddy. Oh, yeah, that's totally a Hydra because it has three heads. Nice. And we can change its AI defaults and stuff. We can make a garden idle. HP multiplayer. Let's try... 20 times more. Oh, look. <laughs> I just spawned another one. That's going to be terrifying. Time for team two. Now, I feel like having carnivorous dinosaurs, like a T-Rex, might be fun. And I feel like our T-Rex needs some better eyeballs. Yeah, that looked good. We'll put that one there. That one there. Oh, yeah. He's got a, he's got a bad case of the googly eye. Let's get rid of that. We'll change it a little bit. Here, googly eye. You know what? On second thought, googly eyed monster seems like a good idea. Can I give him a helmet? Kind of. That's kind of awkward, though. I feel like he needs it for science purposes. That's also, yeah, no, he doesn't need that. I'll create my own helmet with spikes. And because T-Rex don't really have arms, I decided to give him boxing gloves, some harpoons, a machine gun, and of course a ballista on his back. And we might as well, I don't know, I give him this thing on his side. Yeah, that works like a little piece of armor. I think he likes that. Look at how happy he is. Now, I'll be entirely on honest. I don't really understand this game. No, I don't. <laughs> why is why is there a giant Hydra and then boxing gloves happening? And then there's the Gorgon coming in. And his tail's being bit. What is going on here? <laughs> the, Gor the Hydra's like, I'm gonna eat this dude's tail. And then we're just shooting it with a ballista and minigun. And is it gonna die? Don't push me off the map, bro. I didn't deserve this. I did not just... Okay, maybe, maybe the Gorgon will fall off. He's fighting hard. Oh, clubbed him in the head with a boxing glove. Guys, guys, that's not okay. Quit it. And then they're just, they're just mauling him. Oh, he, he grappled on. No. Okay, wait, I got a victory. Oh, I was, I was the good guys. Yay. Maybe if I add a buttload of spikes to his tail, the Hydras can't bite his tail anymore. Also a missile launcher attached to his hip. That could be a good thing. Yes. Let's try that again. Go little, go little Rexy boy. Oh, there's the harpoons. Oh yeah, I put in a bunch of steel spikes too. Those could work. Get a missile launchers. There's one, there's a good blast. I feel like he's doing it. Yes, box the Gorgon with your fake arms. <laughs> it's working, it's working. Is the Gorgon dead? The Gorgon is not dead. Um, This could be bad for T-Rex kind. Oh, with the spike club attack right on the back. That was beautiful. I like that. Okay, this, this is good. They're biting each other. Exactly what you would think of a T-Rex doing, except he's got harpoon gloves, boxing gloves, and, like, missile launching spikes. Oh, yes, that one in the back is trying to bite the spikes. It's not working well. And they, oh, the Gorgon's gonna die. The Gorgon is out. It took a ballista bolt to the head. I don't actually understand what's happening, but I <laughs> I like it because it's googly eyes, mainly because of the googly eyes. Yeah, and it's working. It's working. We're getting lots of bullets happening. I feel that 20 times multiplier is... Probably a little overpowered right about now. <laughs> Good thing that the Hydra is trying to bite the ballista right with its face. Yeah, that doesn't work out too well for you. And the machine guns are like going right at the neck. Oh no, he's doing the same strat. Oh, just before it fell off the map, our T-Rex friend with tentacle monsters. He looks like, what was the guy on, uh, what was that? The Spider-Man movie? The Octo, Octo-Man or something? Octo, I forget his name. But that's kind of what it looks like. He's got a bunch of claws. Or General Grievous. One of the two. I'm not sure yet. General Grievous was a dinosaur? I like that, though. Those spikes in the tail did the trick. Makes me wonder of a Spartan army. Yes, a bunch of these guys could take out our Rexy boy over there. Yeah, him. They're a long way away, but we'll try. Also, probably some Hussars, because they're the winged horsemen. And an elephant with rockets on it. Because why not? All right, so let's see how this goes. We got a rocket elephant in the back. <laughs> Here comes the winged horseman. Yes! And... <laughs> Whoa, it's it's lagging down. Oh, my word. He's got one in its mouth. I wonder if these... Whoa! Oh, the Spartans are so good. <laughs> he's just shaking the Spartans around, crunching them. But it doesn't matter because his tail also has, like, horses attached to it and stuff. <laughs> okay, what about the, the rocket elephant? It's got like, no, that's not a rocket. That's a laser gun. 
Why does the elephant have a laser on it? I don't understand this game, but I like it. Whoa! <laughs> we need a boxing glove up in the air. This is so awkward. I just realized I needed to make a genetically modified human. We have to. We have to name him Kevin. Oh, there's a good tail swipe. We have people stuck literally on the back of this thing. Oh, look, I just got totally flung way off the map. Hot dang. This guy's like, I don't want to fight that Rex. That's okay. He's probably going to die. He won't know it anymore. Whoa, a tail swipe to the elephant's head. And another one. They're going to push him off the map. They're going to cheat. They got cheating in them. <laughs> Look at those googly eyes. He's so excited to be chomping on that Spartan right now. I think my favorite part is just the boxing gloves. Like, <laughs> why does the T-Rex need boxing gloves? <laughs> it's because he doesn't have arms. Oh, did you see that guy get ripped apart up on top? Hot dang, that looked painful. And then he gets bit too. Oh, and another bite. That's great. Elephant's still alive. <laughs> the guy just got launched off the map with a boxing glove. Ooh, and a rocket strike. I think our elephant friend is down. I mean, our elephant enemy. Oh, he's still alive. With that tail swipe. Oh, that is so deadly. Oh, no. <laughs> Rexy is down. <laughs> Wait, I won? I mean, I lost. Tis team wins my team. There really aren't that many dead Spartans. Kind of amazes me. And then the elephant's just here like, he's like, I've claimed my prize. I have won the day. I have carpeted the DM. So it makes me wonder. There are bases, like a humanoid base. I want this. Oh, 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 uh -huh. like this one. Uh-huh. <laughs> I don't, oh, wait, 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 hold up. Why are you guys still here? You're supposed to go away. Maybe I'll try a different color this time, like large grassland. Oh, there's very large grassland. Oh, player army, disable units, victory condition, time of day, so many things. Weapons and armor. Yeah, we like that. All right, let's see what we can do here. We got this guy. Just the legs, no, nothing else. I don't really know what's what's going on here. We have torsos, humanoid torso, or gorilla, skelly man. Okay, all right. We just kind of we just kind of slide that right on top here. All right. I mean, yes. Now we have puncher hands. I like that. I gotta scroll that right, right, and we'll put that there. What happens if I can I just make it bigger? I'm gonna make this guy like super ripped. And by super ripped, I mean his arms are just going to be bigger than his entire body. <laughs> also, that's his, his the wrong arm. That's okay. I don't really care. I don't think he does either because he doesn't have a head yet. Hulk smash! Give me a head. He needs a super tiny head. Actually, you know what he needs? He needs two heads. Because <laughs> he's a, not a Cyclops. What is that with two heads? An Etten? <laughs> he looks hideous. I love him. So what if I fight a hill giant versus my big arm friend? This could be interesting. I don't really know how... Oh, you don't have... I did. I made him on team one. Oopsies. Here. You. No, 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 no. Turn around. There we go. <laughs> also, I gave him shades. Him, him, them. I don't really know. Oh, can he walk? That's the real question. Can he even walk? I'm going to see what happens. No, he can't really walk. Punch. <laughs> it's almost like a helicopter. We need helicopters in this game. And boom. Nice. Oh, no. Don't you dare fly off the map. Oh, ooh. <laughs> I don't like this anymore. Oh, don't you dare fly. I told you. I gave you a big map so you didn't have to fly off of it. Nice. Well done. And attack. I wish my arms were so big that I couldn't walk. Actually, take that back. No, thank you. He skipped leg day. Totally skipped leg day. And attack again. Why is that guy picking himself? He's got a... He's got an atomic wedgie going on. I feel like one of these punches is just gonna launch our enemy here off the map. Oh, attack mode! Boom! Oh no! 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 Oh! 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 Oh no! <laughs> he died. You know what else is interesting? There's a lot of weird stuff in like Thumer Nuclear Godzilla. Uh huh. Oh! I don't know what that is. There's an entire workshop. Ooh, the Roman War Elephant. That looks cool. Somebody made that and uploaded it to the workshop. I need to use that. Is there a clear map button? I just want a clear map button. I don't want new, fine, we'll do a new map. There, should we try Mech Godzilla? We'll do Mech Godzilla over here. Oh, that looks so cool, I love it. There's also one that I found that's called Mecha Kevin. I don't really understand that, but I like it because his name's Kevin. And then I don't know much, but I don't think that the Romans actually used elephants. I think that was like everyone else that attacked the Romans that used elephants. Oh, there's also mutant primates. <laughs> Goral the giant. We need to fight Goral the giant. Should we see if uh, the Romans here, what are they doing? Why aren't they fighting Godzilla? 
<laughs> Godzilla's over there, guys. Oh, look at him go. He's so cute. Just stomping around. Oh, he's like, hey, guys, I want to be your friend. But I'm heavily armored with all sorts of crazy things, plus made out of metal. There we go. Oh, yeah, he's got machine guns. Yeah, this is the good stuff. Oh, and rocket launchers. <laughs> Mecha Godzilla. Yeah. Oh, okay, the horses. The, the elephants, not horses. Oh, the elephants die quick. Oh, this isn't good. Mechazilla is pretty, uh, pretty dangerous here, it looks like. I wonder if he can make it against our friend, the T-Rex. Oh, he just destroyed another elephant. Another elephant. Oh, he's grabbing things with his spiky claws. Eat him. Nice. And he swings that tail. wonder what he's made out of. Like, what's behind the scenes under this? Is it a T-Rex body? There's some sort of dinosaur in there. He also has a ton of rocket launchers. <laughs> Yay. And these little Spartans are no joke either. Oh no, he fell over. <laughs> He's just jumping back up, stopping everything. Oh, that's so cool. Get up, bro. Wow, you can see the, the real dinosaur underneath. It's so much smaller. Ooh, he just killed another elephant. Oh, he just got wrecked. Oh no. The Roman Legion could take, that's why it's an herbivore. Why did we give an herbivore Godzilla skills? I feel like I should use thermonuclear Godzilla instead. Yes, <laughs> this, this looks very terrifying. Why is there a bunch of TNT? Thermonuclear Godzilla is just gonna blow everything. Oh, whoa, okay. There's an explosion that happened. Uh, most of the Spartans are gone, but all of the elephants still remain. They're using their ballistas. Uh-oh, uh, thermonuclear Godzilla, he's got a case of the, oh, he just bit somebody. I thought he was gonna have a case of the dumps in his face. Oh, he is ripping apart. He's ripping apart the elephants. I grossly underestimated his strength. And you got this guy who's still stuck to the elephant. He's like, why doesn't he have legs? <laughs> he doesn't have legs, but his eyeballs are sticking out. Oh, is that it? He did it. Okay, okay. We need to use Goro the giant versus thermonuclear Godzilla. I don't know what Goro is, but we're gonna try it. Wait, I do have two armies. You need to be on team two. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Let's see what happens. Now, can Goro the giant take on thermonuclear Godzilla? That's the real question. Is he, is he like, oh, well, he's just gonna get nuked. Yeah, it's gonna explode. All right. So, uh, <laughs> that was easy. <laughs> Wait, this one's called Poojectile. I feel like I need to test all these out. Let's get rid of Goro. We're gonna use, we're gonna use Shatter. Sh well, let's just add them all. Yeah, the entire team. Cimmerilla, we got King Kong, Wolver Wolverilla, it's Wolverine, <laughs> Knockout Artist, and then we got Berserker and Poojectile. Does he throw turds? I kind of hope so. Oh no, they're all attacking each other. That guy literally just threw his hammer. What the world? You dorks are all supposed to be on the same team. Last time I trust you for anything. You guys want to fight the real Kong? No, don't go that way. They're, the Kong's over here. Oh, they figured it out now. Okay, it's time for the nuke. Okay, they blew up the nuke. It looks like Goro is dead. No, he's not dead this time. Wait, what? Knockout artist. Why does that, oh, whoa. I wanna see the guy throwing the poop. That's what I really want. I think that's this one. Okay, wow. Can the Kongs defeat thermonuclear Godzilla? They're doing a good job of it. They're all up in his business, stabbing and grabbing and punching. Oh, <laughs> Goro's getting his head bit. <laughs> Wait, that's not really it. Oh, and a little right hook and a left hook. Taking him down, but his face is stuck with spiky boys. <laughs> you get this guy back here. He's literally pooping in his hand and throwing it. That's <laughs> so gross. Oh, he's dead now. Nope, never mind. He's not dead. But look, he's going to drop a loaf and then he throws it. That is disgusting. I have a really, really not a good feeling about Thermonuclear Godzilla defeating everything. Even with Goro here, just left and right hooking all the time. Oh, he's got, maybe the belly's the soft spot. Get him, Thorzilla. Throw your hammer at him. Mjolnir. Is that what it is? Oh, look, there's squishy spots you can hit underneath through the armor. Ooh, that hammer does so much damage. Actually, I don't know that. I'm just saying it because I think it's funny. <laughs> it does give a nice knockback, though. <laughs> Get him, Thorzilla. Oh, no, he's going to fall off the map. I mean, yes, he's going to fall off the map. That hammer's pretty cool, not gonna lie. Oh, what a knockout! Threw him off the map and he shatters into a million pieces. I lost again. Why do I always lose? That's a team I want to lose. What about a team? That's Kong. Wait, we need to put him on the other team. Okay, we got Mecha Godzilla, Mecha Kevin, and then Thermo Nuke. We need to put Thermo Nuke Man in the front because he's gonna blow everything up. And then we're gonna put in Kong over here. 
Kong 2021 remastered with Battle Axe. That sounds cool. We'll put him on team two. It's already laggy and I haven't even started yet, which is amazing. And then we start the battle. Yes! <laughs> it's the evolution of Kong. Oh, this is gonna be rough. Okay, someone's got a big mini gun, <laughs> like mini, mini Godzilla. Whoa! Okay, I don't know what happened over there, but I don't like it. Are these guys shooting our friend? Oh, with a clobber to the face. Okay, we gotta see what Kong does here. Um, Kong, oh, wow. The guy got ripped apart. Kong looks pretty sweet though, look at that. Does he have a fish in his hand? It's supposed to be a battle axe, it looks like a fish. Oh, and Kong is down. <laughs> and they've done it, the victory is here. I should do Mechazilla versus Kong. All right, boys, gotta clear. Let's do regular Mecha Godzilla on team one. And then team two, we're gonna do Kong. That'll be better. Just like such as. Very nice. Ooh, I like it. <laughs> Those missiles though. Okay, his little battle axe isn't very good. His face is good though. He knocked him over. Doesn't really have any good attacks. He needs, he needs missiles and junk. Get him, get him Kong. <laughs> I kind of want Kong to win, but I don't think it's gonna happen because he can't figure out how to actually hit. And he's getting hit with missiles. He's got this derpy little stick that he's trying to smack him with, and it's not working. Oh, he did it! I am so surprised! <laughs> Kong won! That's great. They weren't gonna be friends. I was hoping they were just gonna be friends and then sit down and drink a nice glass of tea. Anyway, that will do it for today's video of Animal Revolt Battle Simulator. If you enjoyed it, let me know. Give me some ideas for your own suggested units. And keep your stick on the ice. We'll catch you next time. And I'd like to thank everyone who signed up on Patreon, including Ben, Ellen Hagen, Dickie James, Apollo Bunny, Otto Dave, Eagle Arc, Whip It Good, Seraphin X, Des Bogger, Maxer, Sarnoff, Legacy, Jason McFarland, Deacon, Paul Longstone, and Ralph. And everyone who has clicked that join button down below to become a YouTube channel member. 